Okay, it is definitely a hot Monday out there, and if you are maybe uh, dry during the week or, you know, the LCBO is closed and on a hot day you're looking for a refreshing drink, some mocktails mm-hmm. might be the way to go. Shauna Thomas is here this morning to give us a sort of a great sampling of recipes to sort of keep us refreshed, hydrated, but not, you know drinking. Yeah, so fun, well, not, yeah. Not a bad I mean, thing, of course, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Especially and first, on a Monday. Well, yeah, yeah. and <laughs> first starting, you know, with watermelon. Mm-hmm. And if your kids aren't keen on drinking a lot of water, watermelon is one of the most hydrating fruits mm. you can yeah, give them. So, good. so yeah. on its own, it's yes. fantastic. Yeah, and if yeah. you're looking for a good one, you, you want know? it yeah. to be heavy for its size. So when you right. pick it up, it should heavy. feel yeah. really heavy. Like a bowling ball. Yeah, and then this spot right here, you're looking for a yellow field spot. Bigger the better, mm. um, because it means it was allowed to ripen on the vine. Okay. So that that is really good. And you're also looking for a dull exterior. That also means it's ripe. So those Ooh. really shiny watermelons. Not good. Not so oh, ripe. Oh. So those are kind of Duller the better. couple of things. I mean, you nice. see people knocking on them. Yeah, I do you, that. You can <laughs> do that too, right? You can kind of hear if I'm it's hollow. For, right, yeah, 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 exactly. So those are some <laughs> other ways you can look for it. Okay. This drink is really fun. So Nick, I'm so, gonna get yeah, you to okay. muddle up here. So we have watermelon cubes. You're gonna Just add some strawberry strawberries? Okay. and mint. Oh, you um, put strawberries in. Yeah, well, I like the flavor. You don't have to. Okay, but I okay. love how fresh they are right now. Oh, whoops. Um, that's not that's, the way you want yeah, to go just, in. Just the mint, just the mint in there. Um, and then we muddle it all around, and muddling with the mint okay. in there really brings out mm-hmm. that flavor. Mm-hmm. Um, and you could also you really just, mash it. Like, yeah, yeah, just mash okay. it up. And you could throw this in a blender that's if you wanted so to, but this is kind of fun too. Yeah. Um, we're going to add some lime, and then all we did was add some sparkling water to it, ah. and that's really it. And it is this refreshing, nice. hydrating, like summery beverage. So, wow. so good. And you could do this doing? part in advance. You're doing fantastic. <laughs> I mean, it depends how, like, if you're okay with so, sort of some chunk right, fruit right, in your right. drink, yeah, yeah. then you can leave it like that. So we just pour about half of that in there. Okay. Sorry for um, splashing. Oh, yeah. Out. No worries. Um, so we just pour that half in there. Half a cup with... The, yeah. yeah. Oh. Throw in all the How's fruit that? if you want. That's perfect. Yeah, good. And then just top it up with that, a little bit of lime, and you're good to go. And Tom it is Cruise so and good. Wow. Exactly. Oh, my gosh. There you go. Okay, I'm going to try one. Yeah, try one. And I love the colors, you know, the complementary red yeah. and green. They go the very well together. The fruit's getting stuck in the straw. Oh, no. You really need to muddle it while you're going to maybe a little straw. bit more. We're going to need a bubble tea straw. We're pressed for time, <laughs> pressed for time here. Mm. Um, but this one Delicious I absolutely stuff. love. Just as yeah, a nice, so refreshing drink. Yeah. And no added, added sugars. You just get it from yeah, the fruit. Like I'm exactly. getting a meal. Okay, yeah. this yeah. one mm. looks so, like a pina colada, but it's a pineapple slushie. Yeah, so you can make your own slushies at home. You don't have to go to the corner store and get... It's just sugar and food coloring, right? This one is frozen pineapple and coconut water. Two ingredients, that's absolutely it. And I love this for an electrolyte drink. Mm. So Jen, you you know, are doing tons of sports these days. You need to replenish those electrolytes. Coconut water is so good for that. The Mm. enzymes in pineapple are really good for recovery. So have a sip, you guys. It Mm. is so simple, so good. Um, And if you wanted to get fancy, you could add coconut milk. You Mm. know, you could cream it up a little bit. Oh my goodness. But isn't that delicious? And it is so simple. So, so simple. And Shauna, you have a hack for picking pineapples, because like watermelons, I never know what to do yeah. with a pineapple. Yeah, so um, definitely you can have a look at it. So if it is really, really dark, mm-hmm. it's probably not ripe. Um, right. So as it starts to creep up with yellow from the bottom, it's starting to get more ripe, but you just want to pick the leaves from the middle and ah. Uh, so this one, not entirely ripe yet because it's a little bit hard, yeah. but as soon as they're easy to pull out of the top, you're good to go. You're good to go. Yeah. I'm not joking. Wow. I'm getting this a brain is... freeze. I tried to get too fast, so that's, this that's a delicious. warning for you. Yeah, it's it is absolutely. Really good. Isn't it so good? Yeah. And, and so simple. Mm, yeah. yeah, delicious. Really easy. Okay. And then you've popped some freezies into the final drinks yeah, here. Yeah, this one's just for fun, yeah. for the kids. You know, yeah. we all have these freezies in, a, in mm-hmm. our freezer mm-hmm. sitting mm-hmm. there, oh, yeah. not being eaten. So this is just sort of a fun, like, rocket pop kind of drink, right? It has the red and... The, the white, and then you throw a blue freezy in the top. It can melt in there. It adds right. a little bit of flavor and color. Just something really fun, mm-hmm. and uh, and it's great for the kids to make. And what too. kind of drink is this? The reddish. So it's drink. a cranberry. cranberry. So just okay. cranberry juice. It's like a cranberry soda with just nice. a little freezy yeah. on top. So we had the recipes up there, but oh, where wow. else can we find them if people weren't jotting them down? Shauna? Uh, everything will be on Shauna Thomas Nutrition Instagram, Facebook this week. So mm. keep an eye out for it. Sounds good. Okay, there you Shauna, go. always yeah. appreciate this. Right, great cheers. mocktails cheers. on a Monday. Cheers. Mocktail Monday. Hey, we can actually cheers. drink on the show. I there you go. Thank you so much. Amazing. Thank you so much. Cheers. Mm. Mm-hmm.